Please remember to rate my videos and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Hey everyone, guess what? Two days ago, an untethered jailbreak was released for the iPod Touch 2G, and I'm going to show you how to do it. Alright, so what you're going to need for this is the links I'm going to put on the right in the info, and that's about it. It's that easy. Alright, let's get to it. Alright, so first thing you're going to want to do is download this program called Quick Freedom. This is what's going to jailbreak your iPod. When you download it, uh, you're going to have to install it, and it's going to look like a snowflake. Alright, so what you're going to want to do is open that up and click on the jailbreak symbol. It's going to tell you that uh, you're going to need to install libUSB, I already have that installed, and orig the original 2.2.1 firmware. Uh, you're going to find that on the info on the right as well. So after you get all that, click next. And you can choose to uh, uh, put a custom boot logo. I've done it and it hasn't worked for me so far. So you can leave that blank for now and uh, keep the box for installer checked. It's going to install Cydia and installer onto your iPod. So click next. And now you got to put your iPod into DFU mode. In order to do this, I've shown this in other videos, but uh, in order to do this, you're going to want to do this. Connect your iPod to your computer and hold the home and power button for 10 seconds and then release the, p the power button. All right. So what you're going to want to do is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. As soon as you hear that on your computer, you're going to want to let go. So now we're back on the computer. Now it says that your iPod is in DFU mode, press start pre-jailbreak. That button's right here, and you're going to want to press that. Alright, now your iPod's going to turn white like this. It's going to do everything by itself right here, so you just got to wait for it to do this. Then after you finish, a window's going to pop up saying that it's done and to open iTunes and to install the custom firmware that you downloaded earlier. Right now it's applying the red snow patch. Alright, so see now it's done. You want to press OK and click Next. It's going to tell you to open iTunes. You're going to want to do that. And then it's going to say that it's detected in recovery mode. You're going to press OK. And while you're doing this, you're going to want to click Restore. And while you're doing this, you got to click the Shift key, hold it, and then click Restore. So then that's going to pop up. And then you're going to go into your desktop. And click on the custom 221 firmware that you downloaded earlier. So now uh, it's going to start installing this. This is going to be the longest part of the jailbreak. It probably is going to take you about two minutes or three minutes. And I'll get back to you guys as soon as it finishes. Alright, see ya. Uh, this is going to be your boot logo that you're going to uh, get when you turn on your iPod every time. Uh, just wanted to show you that. Right now it's still installing. Alright. Alright guys, so it uh, finished installing. And it said that uh, iTunes has finished installing your iPod and your iPod is restarting right now. This is what your iPod should look like right now. It said to connect to iTunes. So iTunes is going to recognize this. Uh, there's installer and there's Cydia. Installer's a blue one. All right. So you can set up your iPod here or on another computer if you have your library on another computer. Um, you can close uh, iTunes if you want. Close uh, this because you're done with that. And uh, remember that uh, this jailbreak is untethered. 
So what that means is that you can turn off your iPod anywhere. The uh, the tethered version was uh, that you had to connect your iPod to the computer every time you wanted to turn off in order to turn it back on. So I'm going to prove that uh, this is untethered right now. Turn it off. And there you go. See, it's jailbroken. And it's untethered. Alright, so if, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And please rate five stars if this helped you. Um, Alright, see you later.